Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Hyperlink where we cover the latest Star Citizen news as they drop. Star Citizen Alpha 3.18 looks like we got some more leaks from the Pipeline Discord channel. Before we move forward, I'd like to give a shout out to my Patreons and channel members. Thank you guys once again for your continued support. Okay, so some of the leaks just dropped like about an hour ago, so just wanted to quickly get this to you guys um, right away so before we actually do that just remembered um we're still doing a giveaway for the anvil centurium um if you want to participate you can find a link down below all right so the very first leak that we're finding here is it looks like there's going to be 20 new locations for time trials so that's for racing um all throughout the pu some of them is the garden on Daymar, uh grim hex it looks like the asteroid cluster um, on Euterpe, it looks like it's called the Icebreaker. And Kaplan, it looks like a stadium. So this probably could be on Orson itself. Um, looks like there's another one called VGR Club Track, which could be on Art Corp. And Lorville, there's one called Gateway Race, Tr Race Track. Okay, so uh, these are some of the ones that they have listed here. So... Um, can't wait if this is true i can't wait to actually see it so we can actually go out and practice and do events on okay so the very next set of leaks is um it looks like we're going to be able to earn skill or rank up in the realm of maintenance so it looks like with salvage coming in with 318 it looks like you'll be able to rank up as you do more uh repairing it looks like so the rank levels for maintenance is going to be apprentice, mechanic in training, junior mechanic, mechanic, senior mechanic, and master mechanic. So I wonder what perks you'll get with these mechanic ranks and I wonder what type of missions we'll be getting with that. Let me know your thoughts down below on this specifically. Um, also, it looks like there's going to be a non-lethal shotgun that's going to be coming in and... Um, no, not a non-lethal shotgun, but a non-lethal stun gun. Okay, so it looks like it's an electron-based pistol. I think it's called the I think it's called um, the manufacturer's preacher armament. What is the name here? I don't I don't see the name. I don't see the name, but it looks like the fire rate is a beam. So this is gonna be a beam. It's gonna kind of work the same way as similar to um our tractor beam um kind of kind of and um it says the description says designed to stun and eventually incapacitate incapacitate targets in close quarters the preacher armament uh judge stun pistol is lightweight functional and effective so that's the name it's the judge stun pistol from preacher armaments that is interesting i can't wait so in a previous video i did mention that there there is a new sedative that they're going to introduce that will incapacitate players so they're really pushing it looks like they're really pushing some new gameplay mechanics for bounty hunting that's going to be really cool can't wait to get my hands on that it looks like there's going to be um, another type of weapon that's coming in it's going to be from volt uh fresnel it says and um, this one looks like it's going to be an LMG, which um, the rate of fire um, increases over time. So that's going to be really, really cool. The description says um, Volt's uh, Fresnel is a cheap and effective automatic weapon designed to pack a punch at an exceedingly affordable price, gradually building up in speed and power as it fires. The manufacturer recommends the owner remain vigilant when using the weapons at its prone to overheating. Interesting, interesting. I will definitely be trying this weapon when it comes. The next one looks like a Volt Prism. And this one looks like it's a shotgun. So this is the shotgun here. And it says it's by um, Verified Offworld Laser technologies has introduced an improved charge fire mode to the prism energy shotgun to decrease the frequency 
the frequent overheating previous the previous model may have experienced okay so a new prism shotgun is coming in for volts that is interesting i love the design language for volts so i can't wait to get my hands on that and it also looks like shubin industries is going to have a variant for the Oreo armor um coming in so not sure when all of this is going to be coming in but um if it's going to be 318 that will be interesting 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 and last but not least it looks like there's going to be operator modes i think this is all pertaining to um the ai but some of them that looks interesting is it says quantum air traffic control in quantum so and scm air traffic control um so it gives me the idea that AI is going to finally be able to jump from location to location and possibly chase you or you probably have to chase it as well okay so I'm seeing uh, mining quantum so it looks like AI is also going to be jumping from location to location to mine and probably take back to um, to refine relocation so it looks like um, 318 is is going to be interesting if all of this stuff comes in it looks really really interesting you guys let me know your thoughts down below i will see you on the next one